Hey guys, today I'm just going to bring you a little short tutorial on how to install ELS 8.0, I think. I've never used it, but I am just installed it, and I'm going to show you guys how to install it, and I'm going to hop in game. Let me first exit out of this dumb pop-up stuff. <coughs> Anyways, oh yeah, that's my videos. <laughs> okay, open up your internet. Obviously, I just have it right there, but I'll just show you what would be a lot easier. LCPDFR.com. I'll just put the link in the description, so uh, you know, you got to do all this. Just click the link, and it'll go straight to the page. There it is. Already gotten reviews and stuff. LS eight. Go to downloads. So we only get the downloads. Yeah, that one right there. There it is. And you're just gonna click download, and you're gonna go. Here, I'll show you what, what to do. You might not. If you've never done this, you wouldn't know because I had a hard time figuring out how to first. Click download. I'm not actually gonna download it because I already did. I'll just show you guys like what to do. Okay, there it is. And you're just gonna click download right here. And you're gonna do a security check. Click the person, which would be that. Locks and keys, that clock, uh that, yeah. Then you're gonna click download. Click now to me. That's annoying. And then you're gonna click download file and it's gonna download and it should appear right there. And then you click it. And I'll show you what to do after that. So when you click that, let me just open this up real fast. Close. All right, minimize it. Go to my GTA 4 directory. Rockstar Games. I have the disc, so this is what I have to do. If you have Steam, you just you you know, go to the Steam version of it. If you probably know how to do it. You're just gonna. You don't have to use any of this. Just installation. <coughs> and what you're gonna do is just click that, hold Control, click that, 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 and that, and then drag them all into there, which I've already done, so I'm not gonna repeat it. Drag it right there. All right. Then after that, go to Common Data, open this up, Common Data, Visual Settings, and just drag it in there. And that's all you have to do, and everything will be ready. Alright, and I will be right back. I'm going to start playing the game and see how it turned out. Alright guys, I'm back here. I'm in the game now. And I'm going to test the ELS-8 see how it works with my Minnesota Hell Patrol. That's going to be in the next video. Oh, that's a new sound. That's cool. And the coolest thing about it is more realistic. Check this out. Look, your car takes damage now. And it doesn't fix. And also, the door actually opens. So you can actually take someone down in here. That's pretty cool. I can see how it wouldn't work good for clans, though. Because clans, like, it glitches a lot. And the vehicle's gonna be dented out, you know, when you haven't hit anything. If you know a little bit about it, then yeah, it's gonna happen. Fix my car. Let's see, like the different lighting mode says. Alright. Got some new patterns and stuff. That's cool. It's kind of the same, I guess, with the uh, hazard lights. About this. Yeah, pretty much the same. What about the big lights? Here? It's 
it's pretty cool. Pretty much the same, actually. Well, I mean, it, I guess it's a little bit different, like right here. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like that. I like how it's a lot more realistic now. That was a new button for your sirens. G now instead of H. Okay, that's new. Is there one that's super fast on here? I like fast. Thanks for watching. Hope this tutorial helped and looking forward to seeing some more subscribers and some more likes. Thank you.